Attorney General Jeff Sessions ripped into California's immigration policies Wednesday. The Justice Department will no longer accept the state's refusal to comply with federal law. The inflammatory remarks come less than 24 hours after the department filed a lawsuit against California. California is using every power it has, and some it doesn't, to frustrate federal law enforcement. So you can be sure I'm going to use every power I have to stop them," Sessions said during remarks delivered at the California Peace Officers Association conference. California has enacted a number of laws designed to intentionally obstruct the work of our sworn immigration enforcement officers to intentionally use every power it has to undermine duly established immigration law in America. The Dodge's lawsuit hinges on three specific laws passed by the state. Each severely limits what federal immigration officers can do to nab illegal immigrants. President Trump promised his supporters he would adopt a no-nonsense approach toward illegals. Immigration law is the province of the federal government, Ag Sessions said. I understand that we had a wide variety of political opinions out there on immigration, but the law is in the books and its purpose is clear. There is no nullification. There is no secession. Federal law is the supreme law of the land. Sanctuary policies harm all Americans. California is shielding countless criminals, some of whom are dangerous. Last week Oakland's mayor openly warned residents of an upcoming ICE raid. The mayor of Oakland has actively helped aliens avoid apprehension by ICE. Her actions support those who flout the law and boldly validates illegality, Sessions complained. To make matters worse, the elected lieutenant governor of the state praised her for doing so, bragging about and encouraging obstruction of our law enforcement and the law. I'm afraid this is an embarrassment to the proud state of California. Illegal immigrant activists are getting their way on some fronts. DACA, although vulnerable, has a good chance of being renewed the president. Nearly 2 million undocumented migrants would be protected as a result. However, the Trump administration has adopted a hardline approach toward other immigration matters. HD New York Post 